This is how one team choked out an entire series in just seven minutes. In 2013, the Boston Bruins would face off against the Toronto Maple Leafs in the first round of the Stanley Cup playoffs. This season was a lockout year for the NHL amidst their CBA dispute, cutting the games down to 48, with Boston having one of their all-time teams featuring a prime Patrice Bergeron, Zdeno Chara, and Tuka Rask. The Bruins were looking to add another championship to their legacy fresh off their recent 2011 championship season. Meanwhile, Toronto was entering their first playoff series since 2003. Their roster was headlined by Phil Kessel, JVR, Kadri, and a young goalie, James Reimer. The series had no clear favorite, but Boston did have the edge after earning home ice with their fourth seed finish. The series started in Boston's favor, and through the first four games, the Bruins found themselves with a 3-1 series lead. Yet Toronto was not going to fold that easily. The Leafs wound up winning the next two in the series, leading to one of the most thrilling Game 7s the NHL has ever seen. The game started with the two teams exchanging goals and some incredible goaltending from both Reimer and Rask. But within the blink of an eye, the Bruins found themselves down 4-1 with under 10 minutes remaining in the game. What would happen next shocked the hockey world. The Bruins would receive a goal from Nathan Horton with roughly 9 minutes remaining in the game. With 1.22 left on the clock, another goal was buried by Milan Lucic and with roughly 50 seconds remaining, Bergeron would grab the game-tying goal, making the game 4-4 and sending them into overtime. 6 minutes into the overtime period and a slap shot from Bergeron would cause a scramble in front of the net of Reimer, where Bergeron would score arguably the most iconic goal in Bruins history. I think it's safe to say that Maple Leaf fans are still haunted by this goal whenever they see a matchup with Boston on their schedule.